Hello gamers, welcome to the channel, and in this video, what we're going to be going over is the Prison Break full tutorial, step by step. I'm going to be showing you guys every single thing that you're going to have to do for this to be successful. And right now, this week, dishing out triple cash and triple RP, this is going to be literally one of the best things that you guys can be doing is these mini heists right here. So, once again, there's going to be two setups, and then we're going to actually get to do the heist. So, what we're going to need to do is hook up with Santa's cousin right here. So we're gonna go ahead and hop in this vehicle. He's gonna hop in the vehicle and we're gonna play taxi cab, which I'm sure you guys have done before. So we're gonna take him to this location right here. He's gonna go talk to this dude for a minute and then he's gonna end up getting back in the car. And then after that, we're going to Grove Street, okay? So we're just gonna head on over here where the ballers are. And then what's gonna happen? He's gonna go in this building over here. You're gonna hear a shooting. He's gonna run back out into the building. And then what's gonna have to happen is we're gonna make a daring escape and or kill the enemies that are chasing us, okay? So you guys can do either or. You can just escape or you can just kill the people that are chasing you, which is gonna be the Bala's uh, gang members, okay? So anyways, from there, you guys, we're gonna drop him off at the prison, or not the prison, but the police station, sorry. All right, then from there, we're just gonna go ahead and turn the car in back at our auto shop. Bing, bang, boom. Setup number one has been completed. Now, for setup number two, we're gonna go ahead and go to a location that's going to require us to steal one of these trucks right here, and then we're gonna go ahead and steal a trailer. So there's like a movie set or something going on right here. I don't really know exactly. I think, I'm pretty sure it's like a movie set, maybe. All right, but anyways, from here, we're gonna go right up here, back this thing up. Bam, there you go. Steal that trailer. And then at this time, we will have to lose the police. If you guys have police, I got police. So I had to lose them. So just keep driving. We're gonna have to drive all the way out here to like Sandy Shores, basically, by the prison. Because this thing is gonna turn into a ramp, which I wish we had these things in the game. Like a Pegasus vehicle to where we could actually have a truck and we could set up a ramp wherever we wanted. How cool would that be? All right, guys, so anyways, from there, what I've done is I've just started up a brand new invite-only session, having my last location as my auto shop, so I just spawn right here. And this is what I do before I go in here. We're going to go on down to the snack bar right here. We're going to pick up, uh, well, as many free snacks as I can hold. That's another luxury of having an auto shop is we have snacks over here, and they're absolutely free. Something you guys are probably going to be using, especially during this, because we will be getting shot at. We're going into the prison. We're going to have to go ahead and execute a few prisoners. And then after that, we're going to have to make a daring escape. I'm going to show you guys everything that we're going to need to do right here. And then for the gun loadout, I just went for the hustler loadout, grab some armor, and then from there, we are off. Okay, this is the vehicle that I'm using. So this is the Dominator SAP, bulletproof tires, and it's got like that bulletproof back thing right there. That's going to help out dramatically. So here we go. We're going to jump right up into the prison, okay? And then it will show you on your mini-map of the targets that you guys are going to have to take out. So we're just going to go ahead and turn right back around. And then how do we get in there is going to be at the water tower. So just look for the water tower. The water tower is like right up here although there is a jump back there i think you guys can jump in there too but you guys can definitely get in here from the water tower so here's the water tower watch out because definitely the police do not want you to be here at this time well actually any time as a matter of fact so we're just gonna go in here we're gonna find the prisoners on our mini map and we are going to execute them just be mindful too that they will be running around and trying to hide from you or something like that so there's like the last dude right there okay so, this is what I'm going to do at this time, is i got to run out of here. I'm going to get back into my car, and then we got to go ahead and get the prison truck. Like, we have to stop the prison truck, so we're going to shoot the driver of the prison truck. We're going to escape here first, and then we're going to go ahead and grab Santa's cousin, and then we are out of here. All right, so I'm just going to jump in this car real quick. We're going to have to go out the front gate because there's no other way that we're going to go ahead and escape. So the front gate has like three gates right here. And then it's also going to have three little places that we're going to shoot. So like little security things. There's one like right over here, I think, somewhere. Okay. Oh, no. No, it's right there. Okay, my bad. It's on the wall right over here off to the right. Shoot that right there. It's going to open up this gate. And then once again, I pop and open my inventory. I'm going to my snacks because I don't want to die. And then this one right here is located, once again, off to the right. Be mindful that you're probably going to have a lot of cops on you at this time. So the quicker you can get these gates open and, you know, rescue basically Sasanta's cousin there is going to be the better guess here. All right, guys. And then the one here is just going to be off to the right. It's got a little red arrow, like, pointing down on it to help us out with the visuals. Shoot that thing. Third gate has been opened. Now we're just going to take off down the road, catch up with the prison truck. 
shoot them. And then all we got to do is just drive like right by the, pis uh, the prison truck just like this. So Santa's cousin is going to go ahead and get in our vehicle. Now at this time, we're going to go ahead and have to lose the cops. So we're probably going to have a lot of cops at this time. So I do suggest you guys just go ahead and take the train tracks. That's a great place to go to get rid of the cops. Cops don't follow you down the train tracks. And then from here, we're just going to go ahead and turn him in back to Sasanta. And then from there, you guys, we have completed the prison contract, which once again, this week is dishing out triple cash and triple RP. So any one of these contract missions, I would say definitely worth it. And we're about to check out this payout right here that I'm about to get. There it is. Bam. Passed. Super easy. Completely solo, too. $472,500 with a nice little chunk of RP right there. And as we continue to do this, you guys, I've already done all six of these different missions right here. And just by completing all six of them, I've gotten well over $3 million. And I've done this within uh, not very long whatsoever. All you guys got to do, you can just do this completely solo. Go back to your auto shop and then just start up any one of those contract missions over there. And I do have help tutorials on every single one of them. And just to let you guys know, too, a reminder, there are six different ones. So if you guys are curious on how I complete any of these, go check out my channel because we got all those videos that have just been recently posted. But from there, you guys, thank you for watching. Uh, hopefully the video was helpful and you guys are always a, like, able to complete these completely solo and get tons of money by doing so, which... In my opinion, this week is going to be one of the best, especially running that Union Depository, dishing out $810,000. Super easy. Two easy setups and then the little mini heist, and we are done with these. So anyways, from there, if you guys enjoyed the video and it was helpful, hit like button on the way out, subscribe for new content, leave a comment down below, let me know what you guys think about these uh, payouts and stuff like that this week. But from there, yep, hopefully you guys are doing good. Have an awesome rest of the day. Thanks for watching. My name's Gravesite, and I will see you in the next one. So peace.